Welcome back to the show, everyone. It smells delicious in here. We are, uh, well, I'm just looking forward to eating. Let's just put <laughs> it that way. Honest. And talking to our next guest, of course. Uh, our next guest is Brody Swanson. He is the chef at Salmon and Bannock. How are you, Brody? Hey, Brody, how are you? I'm fine. So Salmon and Bannock, I guess the, the name of the restaurant really says it all. But uh, what else do you have on the menu other than Salmon and Bannock? <laughs> um, we have a selection of uh, bison. We have tenderloin as well as burgers, and we also do a buffalo uh, Indian taco, which is essentially bannock with uh, a chili on top. Oh, that sounds so, good. Explain yeah. the whole idea of salmon and bannock, because uh, it really is paying homage to the traditions of you yeah. Know, yeah, centuries. Well, we're trying to get um, introduce uh, native cuisine to the Vancouver yeah. public. You know, there's such a rich native cultures around the area. Well, Brody, it's weird that this hasn't happened before. I mean, it has in certain levels in certain areas, but yeah. it, that there's not more of it. I mean, this is our shared culture now. Yeah, it area. is. And you as, as see through the logos of the tw past 2010 Olympics, yeah. Yeah. That, you know, it's, it's definitely prevalent in the area. And to have it uh, full on all native food yeah. Is now, is it traditional food. native food, or do you kind of put a twist on some of the items? Well, traditionally native food is a little bland, sorry to say. <laughs> so you put delicious. your chef signature on some yeah, of it? Yeah, so we, we, we add flavor. And, well, yeah. tell us about some of the stuff we have yeah. here. Yeah. Okay, Should uh, we start over here? Yeah. Yeah, over here we have, uh, the that's a uh, uh, bannock pudding. It's kind of bread pudding, but with oh, bannock. Oh, interesting. So bannock with a little bit yeah. of dessert. Yeah. yeah. And, nice. um, and then what do you got here? Those are the Arctic prosciutto rolls, which is uh, musk ox, um, cured as uh, like a, as prosciutto would. Oh, that sounds good. And, and uh, that's uh, candied oh, salmon oh. with a, with a <laughs> Might just dig right tomato. In. <laughs> that's <laughs> tremendous. Yeah. And, Beautiful. And then this one uh, here? It's, it's uh, salmon lox, uh, smoked cream cured. Cheese? Yeah, and there's a uh, herb cream cheese inside. And what are we making today, Brody? Um, we have a salmon mousse that I'm going to prepare, which is a appy at our Beautiful. establishment. So let's do it. Let's okay. do it. Where do we start? Are we going to blend? Um, <laughs> if I could get one of you all to sure. create a little yeah, lemon. Forbes likes to work. I yeah. do like to work. This is a nail file, dress. right? Yeah. Now, where am I putting this? <laughs> uh, just uh, grate okay. a little bit into the, you know. Now, Brody, do you guys say uh, just sort of work within one nation's uh, culinary culture or do you guys go outside to different parts of... Oh uh... uh, No, we uh, have um, we different have dishes from the uh, Ojibwe. Uh, Ojibwe <laughs> Wait, wild Brody, race. let's take a second and just watch me on to try and do that. <laughs> so are you yeah. have uh, from Pacific Northwest and then Ojibwe? Yeah, we do salmon as well as there's Ojibwe dishes and as well as... Um, uh, we're actually introducing a Navajo-style soup in the coming weeks, so... How, how much you, I mean, anyone, anyone who loves food... I'm yeah. really bad job. I mean, part of it's, you know, the exploration and learning about other people from other places right. and stuff. That must be kind of fun for you as well. Oh, yeah, see. it's been a great... Um, like, since I've started, we've... Uh, Chef Eli Isaac, who uh, created the menu, essentially, um, created a great platform, but um, unfortunate circumstances, he had to move back out east. Yeah. So, you know, the platform he set up for me to work on has been tremendous. And, you know, just a, a simple thing. What is bannock? We all know it's a bread dish, but yeah. it's, it's traditional. Is, is that is enough? The one kind God help me. I hope that's oh, enough. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, you did better than I was doing. <laughs> yeah. But what is bannock? Is it, is it different sometimes? Is it region to region? Or? Yeah, from uh, on different reserves, different regions, the bannock is created differently. And uh, we do a, a fried bannock, and as well as a baked, um, as you oh, see here. Oh, the fried bannock, though, is delicious. Baked, yeah, we have the baked rice. This is the baked? Yeah. That's fried? Yeah, and... Uh, yeah, it's... Uh, how much do you go through in a day? <laughs> oh, it, it varies, you know, from... <laughs> but it is weekend. obviously the signature. Yeah, yeah, this is what we... Okay, what's business. next in our blender here? Do we have to fry we, this bad uh, boy up? No, yeah, we have uh, lemon zest, as well as, um, of course, black pepper and dill. You could use fresh, which is just as good, but this has a little more of the dill flavor. Right. And it carries a lot further. And, uh, yeah, we blend it. And what else is in there? Oh, wait, we got to be quiet cheese. while we blend. This, oh, yeah. this is a serious yeah. blender. We have cream cheese as well as uh, salmon. Uh, smoked stuff. It's barbecued salmon, actually. Oh, that looks Beautiful. really good. Yeah, yeah, that looks really good. And what yeah, else are you putting in there? Add a little lemon juice. Okay. I like the fact that your blender's so serious. It's black and decker. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, it's yeah. hard. You need a power tool for this yeah. thing. And, uh, no, you don't need a power tool. Safety no. first. Okay, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, that's like the the holiday log. Right? I, you just, I feel like we should have Blender the TV. girls while that happens. Brody, while you're doing that, can I ask what this is? Is this salmon skin? Yeah, it is uh, the garnish. It is a uh, 
baked salmon skin. It's crisped, you know, more like a chip, like mm -hmm. essentially a salmon rind. You know, if you nice. had pork rinds, if you could. Yeah, like man, I'm, I'm down with pork, pork rinds. So yeah, I think I'll be down with that. Yeah, this is. It's got the flavor of pork rind, but it's. It, good. Yeah, Look at his acids. eyes just popped right no, out of his head. Now I have to try it. Yeah, it's good for you. It's, okay, what are you doing next here, This is a little healthier. It's got some vitamin D and stuff in there. Yeah, with amino acids, and you don't have to worry about the saturated. Yeah, forgot the pork rind, man. This is where it's at. Okay. Oh wow. What's next? Yeah. And I think I have to do a little demo how we. Okay. You guys should sell this and like. Oh, it, it comes as a garnish, and we have. No, to, no, I mean like bag it yeah. and put it in stores. Oh, we've had suggestions to put it in bags. I, it's yeah, that's yeah. crazy. Okay, now we're going to transfer this, and um, you're going to show us how it's done. Yeah, I'm going to. The fine. Now, finishing. if you want to go to Salmon and Bannock and try uh, the delicious mm. items that they have on the menu, the website's on the screen for you right now. But they are located at 1128. West Broadway, if you want to try it out. Okay, now what? Oh, yeah. so we're going to make it look nice. There we go. And I played it. Lovely. That's all you need, people. So make sure you check it out for some delicious food. And don't just have the salmon chips as a garnish. You might want to have them as an entree. Oh, yes. They're <laughs> no. really you might good. Wanna, you might want to ask if they actually have a doggy <laughs> bag we, that we you can just take those in. There we go. There's there my go. garnish for well you. Well done, Forbesy. <laughs> yeah. Can we add a little... Accoutrement. There we go. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. That's absolutely amazing. Can we just use those as Brody. dippers? That might yeah. Just get in there. <laughs> yeah, that's what they're supposed to use. To use it, put it on your bread. Oh yeah. For yeah. Brody, we're gonna take a break, and when we return, sure. yes, there's an app for that. There's an app for a Bangra orchestra. They're gonna be playing for us right after this. Don't go away. Go and bake first, and then I'll go. Here.